Hi, my name is Sally and I want to show you how easy it is to use Adobe Presenter to create movies right on your uh, computer. Uh, you'll need a headset. I recommend wearing one. Uh, actually, I should say you need a microphone. I recommend using one that has a headset. Um, I tend to move my head a lot and I just think it's a lot easier than having one that sits on your desktop. But I'll be happy to help you uh, choose a, a microphone if you like. What I've done here is I've created three slides. Uh, this was my idea for an introductory uh, little movie that you can give to your students that just introduces them to the class and talks to them about you. So a little bit about Adobe Presenter. Adobe Presenter is not a standalone program. When you install it, it's actually a plugin for PowerPoint. And since you're already using PowerPoint, it makes it that much easier for you. When it's installed, you get an extra tab up here on the ribbon. So here's the Adobe Presenter tab. There are a lot of different things you can do here, but the main thing we want to do is record audio to your existing slides. So I've got three slides. One is the introduction to the course. It's got the course title, a little image about the course with the instructor's name. The second slide just has a photo of the instructor, some basic information about their background, and then a little bit uh, snippet down here at the bottom of their personal life. I think that's always a nice touch. And then the third slide just talks about supplemental resources, and we'll cover that uh, in greater detail later. So I'm just going to click on the slide I want to start with. Up under the audio section, I'm going to click the record button, and I start talking, and it's going to test my audio, and this will turn green when it determines that my input level is good. I'm going to click OK. And now I'm basically ready to start recording. Down here is a little button that I can use to click to the different slides if I like. Oh, sorry, this button goes to the different slides if I like. And I'm going to click the red button to begin recording. So basically, you'll just simply start off by introducing yourself and talk a little bit about your course. And there's a nice graphic in the background for them to see. You could click this button to go to the next slide. So here's a photo of me, and I'm talking about my background, how it applies, how excited I am to share this course with you, and then a little snippet of information about me. I'm a lap swimmer, I love dogs, blah, blah, blah. Uh, and then I go to the third slide, which basically talks about supplemental resources. So depending on how much experience you have on the topic as you're coming to my course, I can share some information that you can perhaps read or view some videos before the class so that we're all basically on the same level when we enter the class. And that's really all there is to it. And then you can stop your audio at any time, click the save button, <clears throat> excuse me, and then click close. And now the audio is attached to the slides and the next step is to publish it. So then you can decide how you want it to be published. For you, I'm creating a PDF. I'm going to save it onto my desktop and I'm going to just click publish. I can go over here to my settings and I can do a bunch of different things over here if I want. And we can talk about that more later, any settings that you need to set up. And I'm going to click publish. And it's going to create the Swift movie wrapped into a PDF file so that it will be easy for you to view. And we might want to also consider this for your students because most people know how to use a PDF file. So it's creating the movie. And that's all there so is basically to it. you'll just simply start off by so that's all there is to it and uh, this is a simple sidebar on the side that we can choose to turn off when we publish it if we want but that's just a little bit of a review of how you can create uh, a simple video right from your desktop using your slides and Adobe presenter